Hello everyone, how are you all? So today again we are having a question from JEMEN 2022 paper and this question is completely based on the Bohr's model. If you have any idea about the Bohr's model, then you can solve this problem very easily. Okay, what it is saying, given below are two statements. So we are having a statement 1 and we are having a statement 2 and we are supposed to choose whether statement 1 is correct or whether statement 2 is correct or both of them, uh, both of them are correct. Okay, so let us start from the statement 1. It is saying according to Bohr's model of an atom okay according to Bohr's model of an atom qualitatively the magnitude of velocity of electron increases with decrease in positive charges on the nucleus as there is no strong holds on the electron by the nucleus okay this is statement one now consider the statement two it is saying according to Bohr's model of an atom qualitatively the magnitude of velocity of electron increases with decrease in principal quantum number so it is talking about the velocity right so we know the equation of velocity or you can say formula of velocity that is velocity is directly proportional to g and inversely proportional to n here g is atomic number and n is principal quantum number okay or you can say number of orbit right so here g if g is increasing it means what number of protons is increasing and if number of protons is increasing it means atomic number is increasing then velocity will be increasing if n principal quantum number is increasing then we will decrease okay so from here we can say what we can say if z is increasing then velocity will also increase if n is increasing then velocity will be decreasing and or we can say if n is decreasing then velocity will be increasing okay so from here we can say statement 2 is correct and statement 1 is false okay so according to this what we are having we can say statement C uh, option C is the correct option right so hope you got the answer thanks for watching and have a good day